Thanks for watching our video on Collectors of the Coast. I am Cash. And I'm Dash. And today we're going to go over our favorite arts from Throne of Eldraine. Uh, maybe the most, one of the most unique sets in Magic the Gathering's history. So my first pick is Garrett Cursed Huntsman. I really like the Reaper and how he's cloaked and with all the spikes on him. Really cool. My first pick is a common uh, eye collector. Uh, I think that the little uh, fairy just looks so creepy uh, and with the spike with the eye behind him. Uh, really, really uh, creepy looking card. Um, and I just love uh, even how the how the wings shine. My second is Gadwick the Wizend. He, all the flames coming off him and like, well, the snake. Cool. Alright, so this card I actually got in a draft. Uh, and I was fairly late in the draft, and I, I picked the card strictly for the art, uh, not actually for the play of the card, though it wasn't terrible for me. Uh, but I love the the kids uh, peering in through the window, um, and the idea of the peering in through the, uh, uh, the Hansel and Gretel peering in through a window uh, is really cool. And the text on the card I thought actually was really uh, kind of creepy as well. It's gingerbread like Mother Makes. What is there to be afraid of? My third is Feasting Troll King. Like, my favorite part is the, like, beast going down a mountain. And He's a creepy looking troll, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but to play him, really hard, actually. But he would be great for a green devotion deck. True. Absolutely. All right. Uh, my next is Fairy Guide Mother. Uh, again, another common that I liked. And I just think uh, in the foil, I love the purples in this set and how they've done them um, and how they really set up. Set up. I just think it makes a really beautiful card. Um, and when you get that story border to it, uh, it's just even better. This one is... I think I could have chose a better one, but I'll go with this one, so. My favorite part is, like, the waves coming off her. Okay. And... That's her mantle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, this is maybe my favorite art of the entire set. Uh, I think it is a really creepy looking art. Uh, True Love's Kiss. Uh, the, the, just the flavor and how it adds to the set. Uh, the, uh, the subtext of be careful dear, some people deserve their curses by Marwin Barowich. Um, and the, uh, the, uh, the, the beautiful girl kissing the uh, almost dead looking man coming out of the foliage. My fifth and very last one is Wolf's Query. I like the tiny boars coming out. They look just so cute. And it's all right. So my my last regular card is Oko Thief of Crowns. Um, of course, one of the best cards from the set uh, is banned in a couple of of different formats. Uh, but I just think he looks so cool with uh, sitting there playing with the dagger uh, and just a really unique looking card uh, for, for Magic's history. And this boar token actually goes with my wolf's query. Yep. Yeah. Okay. It's really cute. Okay, and our, our special extra card of the set, uh, we have a fabled passage <gasps> that was made uh, for us. And I uh, just love the card. Uh, and you got the, the lighting up flowers and the dark. And it's just very uh, wonderful looking card. Wow. I did not know we had that. Yeah, it's a bit of a surprise. I always got a surprise. 
I always got to surprise you, Dash. Uh, thank you for watching our video on Throne of Eldraine, our favorite arts. Uh, I am Cash. And I'm Dash. Please like and subscribe our video and uh, tune in to our next one.